how y'all doing? No, I mean, how you really doing? Before Steve Harvey became the host of The Family Feud, making it the second most watched syndicated daytime show in the world. It might not be up there, but that's a damn good answer. <laughs> before he amassed over 3.5 million followers on Twitter and over 1.3 million subscribers on YouTube, before Steve Harvey apologized to Asian men everywhere after sliding them on his talk show and what many consider to be a seriously racist joke. Excuse me, do you like Asian men? No, thank you. Before one of the original kings of comedy officially retired from stand-up during a live pay-per-view comedy special filmed in Las Vegas. 37 years, I love you, thank you so much. Before Steve Harvey mistakenly crowned the wrong winner during the 2015 Miss Universe competition. I have to apologize. Before he made sure not to do it again in 2017. <laughs> Steve Harvey came from very humble beginnings, a kid from West Virginia, who would go on to try out many different career paths. He would sell life insurance, he would clean carpets, he would become an auto worker, and he even tried his hand as a boxer. Steve would do anything and everything on his path to greatness. Even live on the streets while chasing his dream from homelessness to amassing over 100 million fortune. Steve went from rags to riches, but it didn't happen overnight, and he had some pretty big setbacks along the way. Get ready guys, this one's a bit of a tearjerker. Now Steve's been getting a ton of media attention in recent years. Next thing I know, pow, goddamn, right now. And that's what the hell happened. That's it for me, y'all.